Hey, what's up everybody? It's your girl Tanya Lady T. And yes, y'all know what time it is. I'm in the kitchen. Listen, I wanted to come on real quickly and do this quick, simple recipe. Of course, you know when you're on YouTube, you you look at different videos, cooking videos. Anyway, I ran across a video it's called Trailer Park Pizza. <laughs> I think someone said the original recipe is by... Um, uh, YouTube channel, The Angry Grandpa Show. Anyway, I went and checked it out, and uh, yeah, he's real angry. But nonetheless, I really did like this recipe, so I said, you know what, this would be something. Yes, y'all, this is my cheat day, so yes, it is fatty, but I gotta have a cheat day. I mean, I, that's just what I have to have. So anyway, I thought, you know what, this would be a quick, simple recipe, that you, your family can do, you and your children, grandchildren, just something fun, easy to do quick and in the kitchen. And what we're going to need is, you're just going to have a baking pan, two cans of jumbo biscuits, butter biscuits. Of course, you got to have your pizza sauce. I just picked up this brand. I've never used it before. It's by Mama. Mary's, in okay, case traditional pizza sauce. Um, of course, you got to have your cheese. I got pizza blend, and I also got mozzarella. Okay. Of course, like I said, you got your pepperoni. I'm also going to uh, cut up some green peppers, some regular onion, and some mushrooms. And, of course, this is a good time to clean out the refrigerator. I've got a little bit of olives sliced olives i'm gonna just chop them up a little bit more and put that on the pizza and uh we're ready to go um go ahead on and heat your oven to uh 375 degrees and get that preheated and uh let's go ahead on and make uh the trailer park pizza okay i have okay i'm gonna go ahead and put that okay and based on how you like your pizza, you can put it to the website. Why not chunky? Was that a pain? Okay, so these olives that are in here, put it over there in there. Okay, I'm just going to chop it up. Come over there in the pan, too. And all we're going to do now is take mushrooms. And again, as long as you perfectly cut. Why not heat size? Okay, y'all, this is what it looks like frying in the pan. Okay, and remember, we've got our diced onions, green peppers, and mushrooms, and a little bit of leftover olives. And we're going to put in a little salt, just a dash. We're going to use oregano. Just, you can do that to taste. Okay, we're also going to use our garlic powder. Again, you're going to sprinkle to taste. Okay, and then we're going to use a little salt, I mean, excuse me, pepper. Again, this is just seasoning to taste. And you're just going to let these cook on the stove. And like I said, it wasn't even a fourth of a teaspoon of butter that I put in here. And just let that cook up for about about 10 minutes in the pan. Okay, and then we'll go to the next step. Okay, now to the fun part. Okay, we've got all of the vegetables that we're going to put on our pizza that's ready. And see what they look like. Just very tr lightly translucent, not cooked fully. Okay, then in about a 9 by 13 pan... Okay, and flim flam on me, I don't have any uh, cooking spray, so I'm just going to have to use the butter. And this is just optional, but I'm going to just spread butter at the bottom of this pan and on the sides. Even th And this is a non-stick pan, so it wouldn't stick anyway, but this will give it a little bit more uh, crust, crunchy crust. So that's all you need to do with that. Okay, and then what you do with your biscuits, your butter biscuits, is of course you open them up 
and you place them in the pan. You just take your biscuits. And I didn't even, um, on the recipe, I can't remember if they use just regular biscuits, but I'm using butter biscuits. As you can see, it's got little specks of butter in it. And what you do is you just spread them all out in the pan. Now, this is the first time I'm trying this. So I'm just assuming it's going to be tasty. They say it, it's a beautiful crust on this thing. So anyway, I'm going to just put them in the pan. And then the next thing you do is you take your pizza, tomato pizza sauce, and you just spread it all over your biscuits. Okay, I'm going to just spray that out because I don't, I don't like a whole lot of tomato sauce on my pizza anyway. So we're just going to spread it out. I'm going to go ahead and use all of it so it doesn't go to waste. I don't want to be wasteful. Just spread it all around. It smells good. Let me taste this because I've never heard of this kind. Oh, it tastes good. I don't have to add anything to it. I thought I was going to have to lazy juice it up. Okay, so we've got that. Okay, and we already know what's next, y'all. Just put your different pizza cheese in it. I'm going to do a little... Let me do it this way. I'm going to go ahead on, cover the bottom up. And these are two two cup bag full of cheese. The two cups. Okay. Go ahead and use the whole pack. Whole bag. Okay, and just spread it out real good. Okay. Then get your mozzarella. I mean, excuse me, get your pepperoni. Spread your pepperoni. We like a lot of pepperoni. So thick. Okay, we got that full of pepperoni. Our, let me see it's cooled down. Let me use my our onions and green peppers. This is like a trailer park, I should say. And it smells so good. What we're going to do next, I'm going to sprinkle just a little bit of garlic powder on top of that. Like our little bit of pepper. Some more cheese. And this is just mozzarella. Okay, let's just some more pepperoni on it. It'll be just like little individual pizzas. Now I'm gonna put a whole lot. I'm just gonna just a little. All right, so that y'all is that does that look fabulous or what? Now you know that ain't even right. <laughs> and it's pretty heavy too. So this will go into the oven, and they say for about 15-20 minutes. That's it. Because basically, what's gonna happen is the cheese is gonna melt. And uh, the uh, biscuits have got to bake. And that will be about 15, 20 minutes. So let's put it in the oven and see what we get. Look at that bad boy. Mm. Can y'all believe that? This is like deep dish. That's about 15 minutes in. I'm going to let it stand there about another three minutes. Do y'all see this beautiful pizza? Oh, my goodness. That is beautiful. It's like deep dish all the way. Let me go ahead on and try to get one out. All right, y'all. Let's do it. Oh, my God. Y'all see that? Y'all see the bottom of that crust? Oh, yeah, this is deep dish. Deep dish style. And oh my goodness, I can smell the biscuits. It looks done, y'all. Oh my goodness. All right. Now for the taste test. Oh my goodness. Oh my, y'all, that is good. Wow. Y'all got to try it. Again, this is Trailer Park Pizza. Cooking time about 20 minutes. Y'all, that is the bomb.com. Y'all have to give it a try. Mm. Thanks for watching. It's your girl, Tanya Lady T. Bye.